So we must wake up, we must use this media, we must see, not look, listen, not hear, and speak to make a difference. Every person is different, every student is different, every student has special skills. So the school and the teachers need to make sure that these special skills are, you know, developed in the students. As an adolescent, I'm very confused. I have a lot of challenges. My body is going through a lot of changes. So it's very difficult for me to think what is right or wrong. And I'm also vulnerable. I want to experiment. I want to try. <laughs> अपने माता पिता से मन दिल दिमाग और आप सब से ये है वो माइंड 25 करोड़ की शोरों का माइंड जिसमें है कई सवाल हर सवाल पर बंदी है गार्ड आओ खोलें इन गार्डों को और ढूंढने जवाब The vote the age to vote in our country is 18 years old Yes So what platform has the government ensured to hear the voice, voices of adolescents like us They want to pursue for engineering law CA or doctorate hmm. sports or uh, music uh, they, that is not given importance So what can CBSC do to uh, allow children to take those streams The communication of activities is largely related to drawing and painting as they are meant for presentation purposes of schools right so uh, the orientation of activities should be controlled means uh, uh, either uh, every child should be given uh, uh, activities according to his or her talent um so how are we meant to curb this desire to be on facebook i mean parents have tried a lot but that just results in us disliking them and you know saying stuff about our parents which we really should not be so, I mean, what should we do? We all keep saying that uh, children at our age should not be having junk food and all these uh, mm. things. Mm. But we've seen in so many schools that in canteens, that's what we being served. Being served Pepsis and samosas and all these things. So, what do we need to do about that? We, if we can share something with our friends, why not share it with their parents as well? Why not find a companion, a guide inside your parents also. that also, that... The definition, according to me, of liberal is changing over time. I mean, if we get a little bit of liberty right now, the parents, uh, our parents expect huge returns. Mm -hmm. And the question is that bullying, teasing and aggression are leading to unfortunate incidents mm -hmm. in the schools. What steps have been taken by the teachers and the counsellors to overcome this? We 
we have some arrangements in our country for checking food poisoning, hmm. but we don't. We don't have. We don't take many efforts to check on mind po poisoning. Television, movies, mind poisoning. Okay. Movies, films, man, everything is. Man, uh, the young uh, children. Man, this is more in insidious. Correct. Man, okay. so what check? What measures is the Indian government taking and the teachers and schools okay. taking? Okay. Okay. Yes. Very good. I think that's a very good question. Ma'am, I have a question. That ma'am, like romantic relationships, ma'am, today, ma'am, they are so much on a high today, ma'am, hmm. but like, are they because they, like, our parents can't give us time, they are the absence of our love, <laughs> their love and care, because of which we are going for the romantic relationships. Like, ma'am, ma'am, someone said, like, teachers for them, burden should be less. Like, hmm. ma'am, my mother, it's herself is a teacher hmm. of, the, of the school which I read in. Right. So like ma'am, she has so many answers to give to the students mm. but she really, really she doesn't have, she re really doesn't have time to answer my question. Ma'am, my question is like whenever I switch on the television and watch any news channel, mm. most of the time it's rape cases or any murder cases. So ma'am, don't you think the media is having a bad, bad impact on the youth of today? Ma'am, I believe that there is a big flaw. Uh, it's the Indian Medical Association which prepares guidelines for assimilation and preparation of medical reports in schools. That mm. is the reason why schools make medical reports. Now ma'am, uh, the pressure that you have on your mind, as she very well put out, mind poisoning, mm. sleep deficit which decide your mental strength are not even there. And the only reason those medical reports are made so that you can click a photo and put it in the magazine so that more people can take admission. Why not privatize it? Why not give, you know, uh, it's like the coal mines are auctioned. Why not auction it to hospitals so that they, so they can do better as they want their profit and it will benefit both, you know, the students as well as the private companies. We are talking about uh, parent-children uh, communication. Ma'am, what about the children whose parents are uneducated, who are not aware, like, who are not who are actually not aware what no, what are all these things? We all are living in a comparative world. We all know that. And uh, scoring hundred percent, there could be ten people scoring hundred percent. What makes us different from other same scorers? That what life skills teaches us. In so. life skills, is we get to know. Okay, this is happening now. How can you deal with it? All the problems faced by you, you can arrange them in your mind. I will do this first then that Private. and then everything will be done. So an education means that you have complete knowledge about who you are and you know how to go at global standards and speak over there. You should know that actually what skills are needed in life and you have to be complete in yourself. Life skills will help us in making decisions. It will help us in making de uh, decision making, a uh, time set, a proper time set, time management and to choose our future path. We can choose uh, our path only when we learn these skills. These skills are practical in life. They can work. But education is basically grooming your entire persona. She said that uh, uh, you can get a job when you're literate, but I don't think so because uh, even when you go and give an interview, you are not basically judged upon what you know. They ask you something that is not uh, based on your academics, overall, the overall personality, and that's what life skill gives us. So it is basically about grooming our whole personality. There's uh, the need to involve families uh, and all the stakeholders of the community in supporting these uh, activities. But there needs to be a focus uh, on the, uh, the, the teachers as well and on their health and well-being. Uh, An environment which is non-competitive, at the same time it gives enough time to every individual, to every student to introspect. I think the continuous and comprehensive evaluation has opened new dimensions that in addition to academic excellence, there can be many things which can be done as part of life skills education, as part of health and wellness education, as part of other dimensions of the holistic personality development of students. And. Uh, it's a very humbling effect on us, Dr. Nathpal. You found that how enthusiastic they were about the whole program of the three days. Uh, I found the same thing on the teacher's face. The teachers who attended were rather more excited than the students who extend, uh, attended it. And the teachers said, ma'am, this is, it was wonderful, the way it was organized, and the way so many students were given an opportunity to interact. But let me say uh, that I want to congratulate 
uh, CBSE for their wisdom and foresight. Where they are made disabled in various aspects and placed on the streets as professional beggars. At the end, Globally, the sub-Saharan countries and South Asia are standing for 99% of the total child deaths in the world. आपने नशे ले नशा करना शुरू कब किया मैं कोई सोलह साल की उम्र में नशा हट हाँ तो ये ना हाँ पढ़ाकू बच्चा थोड़ा दिखा अपना थोड़ा दिखा हाँ गेर इसको क्राइसिस अ क्राइसिस दैट इज कॉज्ड बाय अस caused by the indiscriminate use of this valuable resource water we come from pohograded slovenia we plant trees why do we plant trees because they are friends and they give us a lot of things oxygen wood fruit shadow we can climb we love trees <laughs>